Shaggy featuring Mohambi, I Need Your Love. Lulu Saidi here and you tuned in to the Rhythm Junction on Hot 96. The time is 12.55 in the p.m. a.m. It's in, no, it's in the p.m. Yeah, it's in the, I got it right the first time. When did I doubt myself? <laughs> in the a, a, a in the p.m. Oh, You're tired. <laughs> yeah, I'm tired. <laughs> it is Cultural Tuesday and we have Ahmed in the studio with us today and we're talking about the Somali culture. Before the break, I had mentioned that there's something I've noticed about Somali men. Mm-hmm. I've mo- noticed that when Somali men walk together, they hold hands. And when they are talking to each other, facing each other, they touch each other's beard. <laughs> And I find that very interesting. <laughs> it is interesting. What is that? No, it's about, again, it's about brotherhood and, you know, it's about uh, cohesive unity of the Somali community. And it's also, it's not only the Somali community who do that. If, if you look at the Italians, for example, mm-hmm. there's a lot of tati, 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 uh-huh. um, which other communities find very, very you know, not not so comfortable with. Yes, yes. Uh, but but there is, it's about it's about brotherhood. It's okay. about uh, taking care of each other. Yeah. Uh, it's about showing bonding. It's about bonding as well to, uh-huh. to the person you're talking to. We, yeah. We slap each other on the back. We touch each other. We yes, walk, you touch each other a lot. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> holding each other. But it's 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 about it's nothing. Uh, it's a cultural thing. It's um, again, it's about. Showing this person that you're holding their hand, that uh-huh. they've got you've got their back, yeah, and they've got your back. Okay, so, so it's about looking out for each other. I had an Italian boss, really interesting guy, yeah. Luca Alinovi, and he used to tell us that Somalis claim that they got uh, their most, you know, some of their culture from us, the spaghetti culture, uh, but we never mix our spaghetti with bananas. With banana. Yes. <laughs> What is but, it with bananas? Every meal has to have a every banana. Every meal has to have a banana. But it's also a n- <laughs> nutritional fruit. Huh? Okay. It has a lot of uh, anti antioxidants and all that. Banana. Uh-huh, uh-huh. So, but we love our bananas. Uh, <laughs> you do? We call it mos. Mos. In, in Somali. Okay. So, we love our bananas. Uh-huh. If, if you uh, brought... Um, Biryani uh, uh, from the coast. Yeah, you have it with, with bananas. With ndizi, yeah. don't be offended. It's, it's just our country. <laughs> no, b- biryani with, with ndizi is the best. Fantastic. Uh, Duncan Jr. asking, is it true that according to the Somali culture, a man is allowed to marry more than two wives? Um, yeah, that's what he's asking. Yeah, yeah. Um, you're allowed to marry more than three. You're allowed to marry four, mm-hmm. but with condition. A lot of people don't get this. Okay. Uh, it's again uh, based on religion. Mm-hmm. Uh, you only marry a second wife if your first wife is satisfied. Mm-hmm. Uh, you satisfy your fi- first wife mm-hmm. uh, in terms of wealth, mm-hmm. in terms of educating her kids, mm-hmm. in terms of uh, social welfare. Mm-hmm. Uh, then you're allowed to marry a second one, and then a third one, and then a fourth one and in you, that order. And you also mentioned you cannot get just marry four out of. Uh, yeah, no, because, because you you want to marry because okay. you're allowed to. It's it's wrong. You also get consent from the first wife, yes, so that you can get the second exactly. wife. Okay, was Somali when you're trying to mojua kama watu asira? Usumbwe msomali, you know? Is that true? Ni ni watu asira? Fanya fuju one. On the contrary, we are a docile community, okay. very humble, very simple. Uh-huh. Uh, even in the streets of Nairobi, if you hit a Somali vehicle. Now, mm-hmm. Mumbia Poli, it just drives away. It's okay. Yeah, they don't have a lot of baggage. Uh-huh. Simple people. Okay. Uh, Business-minded. Uh-huh. They do their stuff. Mm-hmm. Very pious people. Religious. Yeah. Almost every other mosque in Nairobi has a Somali uh, population uh, praying there. Yeah. Uh, they have a lot of trust on each other. They have a lot of faith with mm-hmm. each other. Mm-hmm. So it's it's their simple community. Kusema about uh, Fujo. Uh-huh. It's but I have to warn you, yes. if you want to fight a Somali, uh-huh. look around. Ukimona moja, usidhani ako peke yako. Kukona kirende inafuja. That is so true. A final one as we leave. Ahmed, thank you so much. Um, a final uh, a final one before we leave is, kitu gani ambacho unezafanyia msomali, umkasirishe sana. Kama from my people, one thing you can do to my people na like, uwakasirishe ni mwishe friends, is 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 br- breaking friendship. Because in my people, we don't have friends. We have ndugu. Yes. Tunamini that, yu si rafiki yangu ni ndugu yangu. Yes. So, in my community, mtu ambu, when, when you break that friendship, like, yani, jua tu you imeisha like bye yeah it's it's about what, what betrayal. about yours? betrayal betrayal uh, because like i said uh, at the at the start of the program 
trust is very important within the Somali community. Mm-hmm. Breaking that trust and betraying the person who trusted you is, mm-hmm. is something that uh, will never be forgiven. Mm-hmm. Even your clan will disown you. For example, if you mm-hmm. if you borrow a hundred thousand from me mm-hmm. and then you don't return it, for example, and then I tell my your clan. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you are dead. You're finished. Are you serious? No one will trust you again. Because now you betrayed you the betrayed trust. You betrayed the trust. Thank you so much, Ahmed. Thank you it so was much, a Lily. pleasure having you here. Guys, if you have any more questions, you can find Ahmed on Twitter. At Asmali77. At Asmali77. What team are you supporting in the FIFA World Cup? Oh, my team has already been beaten. Oh, really? <laughs> Don't tell me it was Portugal. Japan. Oh, what? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, because of why? <laughs> because of uh, uh, yeah, yeah. You were the enemy yesterday, <laughs> weren't you? Thank you so much for coming. Thank you for having me, Lulu.